A soldier from Chicago suffers a devastating injury and then he's told that he's never going to walk again. And today he's proving doctors wrong thanks to his own determination and some cutting edge technology. CBS 2's Jim Williams reports from the Rehabilitation Institute of Chicago. I just need my gloves. For Roosevelt Anderson, thank you. This new chapter of his life requires a little patience. Definitely needs you to tighten the knees up once I stand. But it is well worth it. Today, the 32 year old South Sider is walking. When you're standing there like that, how does it feel? Oh, this feels amazing. You know, I, I'm so used to sitting in the wheelchair. A wheelchair since a 2012 motorcycle accident while he was in the Army. I was thrown into a ditch. Um, and that's where I broke my neck and shattered my spine. Leaving him paralyzed from the chest down. When the doctors told you the extent of your injuries, what was your reaction? Well, I didn't believe him. Using the same determination he developed as a special ops soldier, <laughs> Sergeant Anderson put in nearly three grueling years at the Rehabilitation Institute of Chicago. Now he'll walk out using a $70,000 rewalk exoskeleton from an anonymous donor. It's a dream come true, it really is. Anderson is the first Chicagoan to use the rewalk exoskeleton at home. But for now, his sister Angela, uh -oh. or someone else has to be with him. I love my brother and I just wanna be there to assist in any kind of way. There's a chance that he might lose balance. Right. And if he falls down, head first or head backwards, He's strapped in with 50 pound device. Roosevelt Anderson is standing tall. Okay. Looking forward to a nice stroll. It's exciting, you know. I'm like, I can't wait for this summer to walk down at Michigan Avenue. At the Rehabilitation Institute of Chicago, Jim Williams, CBS 2 News. Sergeant Anderson takes part in air rifle competitions and he hopes to win a spot on the 2016 Paralympic team. And boy, you got to wonder who made that donation. What a wonderful thing. Well, look at the difference yeah. it's making in someone's life. And I'm sure that's why yeah. it was anonymous. They just wanted to know. They didn't want to get credit for it. And he's just phenomenal, isn't he? Just he certainly is. Incredible brain there. Uh,